when I first heard Southern music, like I had the full ear, just being honest, I, I had the East Coast bias. We didn't fuck with nothing West Coast, nothing down South. It was all just like, what is this? We didn't understand it because hip hop started in the East and hip hop was this. I'm an international mudslinger, gunslinger, fake dogs, pull it and don't shoot it and blame it on a bum finger. Or lyrics, you know? So when I started, like I said, when I first heard Stack and I started hearing Southern music, I was not a fan. But when I actually moved down and I was in the studio with Charlie P and Jelly Roll and I was just seeing how they bop to the beat, they were doing something like this. And it was just, I get it now. I see how they move to the beat. It just made me feel the music more, seeing how they wiggle with it, you know? It's Charlie be like, oh, this shit. And I was just like, now I understand how they hear these beats. I understand why they vibe to these beats now. And that opened up Southern hip hop to me. Now, I was in love with another style of hip hop because it's still hip hop, but now I understood it, so it opened up southern hip hop to me. You know what I'm saying? So just learning how Southern rappers heard the beats opened up the production for me. Now I knew how to make Southern beats. Very reliant on 808s and the tick and the hi-hats. So now I was like, all right, the, the production expanded.